I just want to start by saying you all are a very, very, very good looking audience. I'm imagining all of you naked right now. <laughs> I'm a little new at this, so it puts me at ease. Um, the other, uh, sometimes when I'm feeling lonely, um, I like to go to retirement homes and see if anybody remembers me. <laughs> if nobody remembers me, I like to ask for a date. I'm currently dating this really, really great 75-year-old man. He's deaf, so it's like he really listens to me. <laughs> we had a really great date the other night. I read him Mozart's Fifth Symphony. <laughs> but I, I really like to meet people through wrong numbers. <laughs> Excuse me, is this Janice? No. <laughs> no, it isn't. I think I have the wrong number. No. <laughs> no, you don't, but I'm really, really glad you called. <laughs> yeah. I'm dating a guy right now that I met through a wrong number. He's sweet. Um, I like to sometimes play Jeopardy with my microwave when I'm making popcorn. If my microwave were Alex Trebek, I'd be like the greatest all-time microwave Jeopardy champion. It's true. <laughs> Uh, when I was younger, um, I wanted to be an astronomer, but my mom always made me go to bed before dark. <laughs> I have one of those light switches in my house that doesn't belong to anything. Do you guys have one of those? You turn it on and off, on and off, and it doesn't do anything ever, ever. I had this nightmare the other night that maybe my light switch belonged to an alternate dimension and every time I turned it off, a baby dies. <laughs> it was a scary nightmare. <laughs>